okay, wait a minute. Now is not the time to start thinking about switching to Windows. You're stuck at the Apple logo. You're frozen at the Apple logo. You can't start up. Well, the same thing happened to me and it took me four days to figure it out, but I finally did. So I'm going to share this with you and hopefully it will help. Okay, so what you're going to have to do is start up from a rescue drive or a recovery drive. Once you start up from the rescue drive, you're going to come to your desktop. And then what you're going to do, you're going to go up here to the go menu. Go to the go menu and go down to go to folder. You're going to go to go to folder and then you're going to put in the following parameters volume for the file for the drive volume that you're trying to access your drive hard your hard drive name mine is Macintosh HD system forward slash system forward slash library then once you do that you're going to go to that folder and then you're going to come down to that in that folder to the folder called extensions and when you come to extensions, this is where the problem lies. Now, before we go any further, please note that you must back things up before you start mucking around inside of this folder. If you mess things up in this folder, you could destroy your whole system. So you should back up this folder or back up whatever you're going to remove from this folder so that you don't destroy your system. We're trying to avoid reinstalling our system that's the whole purpose of this because in the final analysis that's what a lot of the online sites say that uh, in forums say that you should do you should reinstall the system but we don't want to do that we don't want to have to it's, it's a pain in the neck to have to do that so these kext files are the issue the thing is you have to remember what is the last thing that you installed on your mac did you install uh, drivers did you install firmware did you install a new app what did you install last on your app on your Mac it will show up here whatever you installed last that most likely is the problem that's causing the uh, stall and freeze at startup for me I installed the market of unicorn MIDI drivers for the Motu fast lane MIDI interface when I did that everything went haywire so what I had to do was I came into the into the extension folder and took out the KEXT files for the Motu MIDI interface and also I had installed something for I forgot what it was something for Avid and I took those and took them out and put them into the trash. I didn't delete the trash, I just put them into the trash. Then I you you close this out and you restart and when you restart then you will see that you'll be able to start up normally. It may take a little bit longer to start up normally, but it's it's it eventually it will it will start up and then you'll be good to go. That's what I found is the solution to the problem of freezing and stalling and being stuck at the Apple logo during startup. So now you see you don't have to jump ship and go over to Windows. I hope you can get this thing to work for you because I know how frustrating and aggravating it is but you can get it to work. Please hit the like button and please, if you can go over to newblackmusic.net and download some of our music because that's how we survive. Thank you very much for stopping by and we'll see you on the next video and I bid you peace.